On Sunday, we're having soup and salad. I made pasta fajol. There's macaroni, and I used chickpeas. There's bacon and kale and onions and celery and tomato paste in there. The green salad is the usual things. Lettuce, cucumbers, red bell peppers, some sweet onions, olives, mushrooms. I think that's everything. And then I made some garlic toast on the side. And I have some green tea kombucha to go with it. On Monday, we're having a chef salad. So this is lettuce, cucumbers, red bell peppers, mushrooms, avocados, sweet onions, hard-boiled eggs, sunflower seeds, trying to remember everything, and then I made a, like a honey mustard dressing to go on top. On Tuesday, we're having okra curry. This has a coconut uh, milk sauce. There's okra and red bell pepper and chicken, and I put mushrooms in it, which uh, the recipe doesn't call for, but I added that, and it's over brown rice, and I will put the link to this recipe in the description box. On Wednesday, we're having chicken cacciatore. So there's whole wheat penny pasta and pasta sauce. I added red and green bell peppers and some garlic and onions and should have added mushrooms, but I didn't have any. And then um, there's some chicken leg and chicken thigh that braised in the sauce and a garden salad on the side. On Thursday, we're having tarragon chicken. I've had this many times and I have the recipe on my channel. Um, we're having it on whole wheat toast today and some uh, peas on the side. Today is Friday night and we made pizza and I used the Trader Joe's vegan cheese. It's like the Daya. I've used the Daya before and I love it. So I got the Trader Joe's trying to save money and it is a disaster. It just completely melted away. I will talk more about that on the review on this cheese, but that is my pizza and a salad to go with it. On Saturday, we're having chicken tikka masala. This recipe is a Jamie Oliver recipe, but it's on the Martha Stewart website, but I'll link it down below. But there is chicken breast and a masala paste that I made, um, and I made up a bunch, so it's in the freezer so I can make it more easily next time. And let's see some cilantro lime brown rice um, and then it's topped with some yogurt like plain yogurt I'm using this dairy free plain yogurt but it has a lot of sweeteners in it so it's not exactly the right kind of yogurt but it's what I could find and then there's also almonds and cilantro 